Good morning, everyone. Welcome to TEDx Cape Town. Um, I'm Richard. As a um, engineer and designer of urban spaces, and also as a man, I come from a, a long history of compartmentalizers. Um, we have taken our cities, our urban spaces, and we have broken all of the resource flows down into water systems and sewer systems and power systems and food systems. And nowhere else in the world do they all sit in nice little convenient packages. Um, but no, we have done it. Our engineers have done it for us. And it really doesn't work very well that way at all, does it? And this talk, my idea worth sharing, just to get it out there, is that these are one system, and how can we look at, at dealing with them as such? When we consider our urban spaces, we have used the economies of scale as a fabulous justification for moving everything out of them, for generating energy up in Gauteng and for food everywhere else. And, and what that's done is it's, it's given us fairly good efficiencies within one little package, but it hasn't allowed us to link them at all. And the premise of this is that by decentralizing and by moving our primary resource systems into local zones, we can actually start to take advantage of the nested systems within them. The idea that when you use water once and then send it to the sea, what you've got is a very good system for taking nutrients out of the soil and putting them into the sea. You don't have a very good system for water and cycling it. And so what I'm here to share with you is that it is actually possible to design our urban spaces in a different way. We can take localized urban storm or localized water treatment systems. We can extract the nutrients. We can then use those nutrients to produce food locally. We can also extract the energy, and we can use the energy in our buildings and in our urban spaces locally. Further to that, we can reuse the water, either in the food system or in our buildings. And even another step is that if we look at actual passive biological water treatment, which Bernal referenced earlier, we can start to create urban nodes of biodiversity. And so we get this water, sewer, energy, nutrient, food, water, 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 water system. And that is, that gives me quite a lot of hope, I suppose I should say. And really, when it comes down to it, water, sewer, power, food. It's all one system. Let's design it as such. Thank you very much.